Hey guys, um, I wanted to show you this um, launcher for Android, it's called Go Launcher X. I am currently running it on my um, Dell Streak. Um, if you have ever used a Streak or if you own one, you will know that the um, default um, stage UI from Dell is more or less shit. Um, I will show you that quickly now. So this is the default interface you get with um, with the um, Dell Streak and you have um, what they call um, Dell Stage UI widgets which are okay, you can still add normal widgets though nothing special um, I have however um, installed Go Launcher EX so when I press the home button I have an option of which um, launcher I wish to use um, so I will take you to Go Launcher EX now um, so I've basically just got um, you know some of the default widgets um, on the screen now and um, application links and the Winamp um, music widget. So the one thing I really like about Go Launcher EX is the um, menu. Um, I'm not sure if you can see it though it says all on that button there. This is where all of the applications are. And if you um, are an Apple user like myself, I use both Apple and Android. If you hold down an icon, you, uh, you will um, see a little X come up in the corner. So you can easily uninstall the, um, uninstall the application, just hold down the icon, click the X, and it's gone more or less. So Apple users would appreciate that. You also have a recent application um, folder. I don't think they call them folders, so um, yeah, you've basically got an area where um, all of your recent applications are displayed. And this is my favourite part, you have an area where all of your running applications are installed. Um, if you use Android, then there is a good chance that you have um, advanced uh, task killer on your Android device. So you can close up any running um, Android applications that you don't want, don't want to use anymore or you don't want to be running. So this sort of has a version built into it. Um, I'm not sure if it is as good. I've only ever used um, the free version of Advanced Task Killer. I believe there are also a few other options if you hold down an icon. Uh, yeah, if you hold down an icon in um, the running tab, uh, you get four options. You can either close the running application, you can lock it, so um, when you click the close all button there, um, it won't close. You can go to it and you can view information about it. So at the moment I've got a lot of applications running, or a few. Um, most of these applications um, start by default. I haven't actually started up the um, assistant run or the backup run or the quick office. Um, and I haven't figured out yet how to actually close these applications because whenever I close them they open up again though I will do a demonstration I will click close all programs and it gives you a warning that all running programs will be closed and I'm going to click OK so now I have only got two applications um, still open uh, these applications have the lock on them. I put the lock on the battery application. I'm not quite sure what the dumb application is. I didn't put the lock on that. Um, now I'm going to show you some of the settings if I can find them. Uh, yeah, I won't really go into um, detail with all of the settings. However, I want to show you um, the themes available. So I'm going back to the home screen now. And I believe they have a preferences button next to settings. So settings um, should be Android preferences. Should be um, for the Go Launcher EX, I believe. Okay, and I'm going to look for theme preferences. And these are a few of the free um, themes that I have downloaded. The one thing about um, Go Launcher EX is there are a few, well, there's a limit to the amount of um, themes available. Um, I will show you um, the cartoon theme now. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to click apply. And as you can see, the theme um, has applied. 
and it's got the um, run wallpaper which um, sort of moves along and um, I'm sure you've noticed um, it has a different icon set which I, I quite like um, I'm a bit pedantic when it comes to the icons um, I like the default icons usually um, and I don't like um, the menu button they have on the side here for this particular theme it looks like one of the characters from Spirited Away personally so um, yep it all looks pretty much the same as before just with a nice um, theme on top of it all of the um, same functionality also as you as I said before um, when I click the home button um, I get two options the Dell stage and the go launcher and there's an icon there used by um, default for this action so for example I could tick that and click Dell stage and as you can see it is pretty much back to normal and um, it won't come up with that um, menu anymore when I click on it um, and say I want to um, get back to um, the other say I want to get back to um, the other launcher there is probably a way to um, do it in the settings I haven't looked um, however I have um, downloaded this application if I can find it um, it lets you um, um, switch back um, or switch between launches pretty easily um, where is it? Oh yeah here it is the um, home switcher for FOYO see um, your default home app is Dell Stage um, let's see if I can get this to focus and on the list here I have got um, Dell Stage and I've got Go Launcher EX and there is a button here in the corner I'm not sure if you'll be able to see it it says um, Clear Default and it takes you to the Dell Stage yeah, oh yeah, it basically takes you to the Dell Stage application so it must be under the application settings and um, here I can click clear defaults, I'm not sure if you can see this or not and I can now go back to the application and it says that I do not have a default application now I am going to click my home button and I once again am presented with this prompt I'm going to now tick the default box and go back to go launcher um, I probably should have deleted the widgets on um, the Dell Stage UI um, launcher first well you're supposed to, um, I haven't noticed any real effect um, this might be because it could be using resources even though you aren't using the launcher like if you have an email widget I'm not completely sure about that though yeah that's, basic, that's basically it um, that's what um, the launcher looks like um, you can get themes for it, I'm not going to go through all of the settings um, you know, I haven't even gone through them all yet. And that is it, and I hope you enjoyed this video.